Welcome back. If your child wears glasses and feels a little self-conscious about it, worry no more. There's a great event headed your way to help make your kid feel cool about wearing glasses. And here to tell you more about it is the president of OptiWow, Yvonne Goldstein. Yvonne, welcome back to the show. I haven't seen you in a while. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. The same. Yeah. Uh, always exciting to talk to you because your business is such a cool, fun, smart it, business. It certainly is. Yes. It's very exciting. Uh, so tell Kids us, are always exciting. Yeah. And, and a handful, right? Yeah. <laughs> a handful. Exciting good and exciting bad. Absolutely. Yeah, all Absolutely. Over the place. Yes. Yeah. So OptiWow, for people who uh, maybe didn't catch you the first time you were on the show who don't know, tell us what it's all about. Yes. OptiWow is, well, actually OptiWow started from a pediatric optical shop that we have in Miami Children's Hospital and now it's grown into an internet company an e-commerce site which you know gives the opportunity for moms to find the appropriate kids eyewear which you know it's very hard to find believe it or not yeah uh, you know stores that really specialize in kids eyewear is not you know very so, common so why is it hard to find if they just go to regu regular optometrists or ophthalmologists they just don't have a wide they selection? have a very if they have any at all uh -huh. is very small and you know kids come in different shapes different sizes so you know it's not a one fit kind of situation so you have to have a lot of styles in order to you know, be able to fit that child appropriately. So I think the first thing some people might think is, well, how do you shop for glasses online if so much of the part of glasses is trying it on? You know, how do you, how do, you do that? Well, we have, uh, actually, we offer the virtual try-on where you can actually upload a picture of your child and try it on. We also, you know, on a one-to-one, -one, we also offer customers a try-on kit. So, you know, we ship a couple of frames to them. They try it on. It, you know, if it's their first time fitting the kit. Of course, there's all this anxiety. But, you know, eventually they come back. They are happy with the service. They're super excited that they can find cool kids' frames and, you know, super trendy mm -hmm. out there. And they love it. We're talking about a lot of different styles from a lot of different designers? Yes. Yeah. and specialized also. We treat all kinds of eye problems from the basic to the most complex. So, you know, uh, you need sports goggles, you need the uh, down kids eyewear, you need ski masks, you know, anything that has a prescription on it that a child needs to see better, we have. Great idea. And uh, now you're excited because there's something uh, called the Great Glasses Play Day. Oh uh, my God, we're yes. We're some time talking about <laughs> of that. Course, of course, of course. It's actually an annual event that is being celebrated across the U.S. and uh, it celebrates kids in glasses, basically. That's the name, that's what it does. We want to make those kids feel special. You know, a lot of these kids and a lot of the parents, especially the ones that's never worn glasses, it's like a big deal for them the first time they're told that their child needs to wear glasses. So, number one, we want to celebrate that child that goes through the whole process of having to wear glasses sometimes unfortunately made fun of in school we want to make them feel that they're special and that it's great to wear glasses and that they interact with other kids that are in their same situation as well as their parents meet other parents that are in the same situation so we think this is a great event it's going to be done for the first time in miami and we are so happy to be able to organize it Mm -hmm. I can't, you know, I can't wait. <laughs> and it's at the uh, Frost Museum of Science, Saturday, May 2nd, correct? Correct. Yeah. So, all right, so specifically, so I know you just kind of touched on it, but what, are, what, what else will be happening that day for these kids? Well, uh, Dr. Roberto Warman, a very well-known pediatric ophthalmologist, uh, will be there giving a talk, as well as our, one of our reps from Nike, Steve Goldberg, will also be addressing parents and you know the importance of kids wearing the correct frames and wearing sunglasses and protecting their eyes, especially living in South Florida. And uh, we're gonna be hosting, a, we're gonna have also a pizza from Papa John's and cupcakes from Misha's Cupcakes. So we're super excited that they're gonna be there with us. Delicious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it'll be a couple of hours of parents to get some information, some education, and you know, kids to be able to interact with others. You know, it's it's interesting because I didn't realize how challenging it was for kids who wear glasses. I, I didn't know that there was that much of a stigma attached to well, it. But, there's but there a is tremendous, a, yeah. tremendous stigma. You know, you, you always hear the little four eyes, or you know, the kid has four eyes, ha ha ha, right. kind of situation. Yeah. Now, fortunately, it's not like in my times when I was growing up and I had to wear glasses, you didn't have the pretty sunglasses or frames or, you know, so it was difficult. Today a days, you know, the same fashion the parents are wearing, 
are, is available for kids. So, so it's, it's not just a, turning you know a, a negative into something neutral. It's actually turning it into a positive. Right? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. it's it's a fashion statement, you know. And kids watch TV like their parents, so you know they want to wear what their parents are wearing, what the adults are wearing, what the movie star is wearing. So now they can. Yeah, you're never too young to be hip and cool. Exactly. Right. Exactly. You know? Just get the ladies to date, and then you need like the cool move where you take them off. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Let me tell you, you rock, rock some glasses. Yeah. 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 All right. So uh, give us again all of the various ways that we can find OptiWow. We can go see in person. We can do website. Okay. The main store is located inside Miami Children's Hospital, and then we have an e-commerce site that you can visit OptiWow.com, mm -hmm. and it, you know, that's basically. Where we are. And, that's it. <laughs> and then if people want to go to the event again Saturday, May second, it's at the at Frost the, Museum. Yeah, Patricia and Philip Frost Museum of Science and in Coral how, Gables. And how people are RSVP for it. They can RSVP at social at optiwow.com. All right, so it's Okay, be and the whole day. community is invited to attend. Yeah. Anybody that has kids in glasses, please feel free to come. And even if you don't wear glasses, you get pizza and cupcakes out of it, so just put some on. Exactly. Yeah. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> so good to see you again, Yvonne. Likewise. And, um, Thanks you know, for having me again. Our pleasure, and enjoy the event. Have a Thank great time. You.